how can I increase the likelihood of seeing the Prophet ﷺ in a dream? The first thing to keep in mind is that seeing the Prophet ﷺ in a dream uh, is a blessing to the Ummah because we are not seeing him in person, we are not living with him during his times Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. However, there are some conditions and guidelines to keep in mind. The first is that what you see in the dream must be uh, in agreement with the authentic reports about the physical description of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And so these scholars, when someone would come to them and tell them, I saw the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and they would describe what they saw, they would know whether this is in agreement or not. Uh, another point to keep in mind, you would not see the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam in a dream commanding you to do something that contradicts the Sharia ah, or adding a new ruling to the rulings of Islam. Uh, however, the more important thing to keep in mind is if you want to see the Prophet ﷺ in a dream, you want to simply live by his sunnah, emulate him, imitate him, think about him often, reference the Prophet ﷺ in every aspect of your life, send salawat upon him ﷺ, and learn about his biography, learn about his companions, learn about uh, the uh, struggles that he went through ﷺ, make dua to be with him in Jannah, make dua to be with him on the Day of Judgment, follow in his manners with your family, with your spouse, your parents, your children. We find that a comprehensive following and emulation of the sunnah and an increase in our love of the Prophet ﷺ is the only way to get closer to this. Ultimately, however, it is not guaranteed. You live by it, you act upon it, you make dua for it. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to make us of those who have true love for the Prophet ﷺ internally and externally by action. And Allah knows best.